Hey guys, welcome back to Bill Moyer Rip City. I know it's been a while, so I thought I'd do a rip uh, for old time's sake. Try to get back in it. So we got a Target Mega Box Mosaic Basketball, but we're not opening that today because, oops, I did it again. I was at my local Walgreens and yeah, I ran into this and I thought, why not? At five bucks a pop, why not? And I was really tempted not to buy this and just kind of forget about it, especially after my boy Sir Collect a Lot bought a bunch and didn't get any packs out of it. And um, the word on the street seems to be that um, there's been of a bait and switch that's happened. Uh, a lot of these packs were. Coming up with uh, NFL Select 2020, and all of a sudden, they've all changed over to some random stuff like Canadian football and whatnot. So, I initially mean, wasn't going to buy any, and uh, had a change of heart. Thought, why not? Let's let's give it a go. So, here we are, football collector's edge. We're looking for an auto, and we're looking for a good pack, and hopefully. It's an NFL Select 2020 pack. So this one looks pretty... Doesn't look like it's been tampered with. It's got that solid tape job or glue job. And let's open it up. And oh no, that does not look like a Select 2020 pack. This will be our Notre Dame trading cards. So my suspicions were right. We probably should have passed on this. But there does seem to be a higher volume of cards in there. So let's take a look at what garbage we're going to pull from these. All right. So we got an Aaron Rodgers Prestige, Kadarius Tony Sage, Cody Taylor, Otis Henderson, Thomas Graham, Trevor Lawrence, Jared Dokes, Derek Forrest, Blake Pro, Mon, Ross St. Brown, Zach Wilson. Richard Johnson, John Renstra, whoever that is, Let's see Gizmo Williams, Otis Anderson, David X Alexander, Wendell Tyler, Marcus Allen, Neil Lomax, Bitch Wolfolk, Ricky Feature. Jerry Miller, Steve Bartkowski, Dave Brown, Al Baker, Jerry Ellis, and C.D. Lamb. Not even an auto from the Sage brand, which we had been seeing. And we have this baby. I'm not even going to bother. So I think safe to say... Probably avoid these. I'm just gonna have a quick look, make sure. Yeah, it's totally possible that someone could have had a peek from the bottom there. Um, I didn't do that. Uh, otherwise, I wouldn't have bought this if I had known there was gonna be one of these in there. But also, I wasn't gonna do that. That just seems really shady. So, you live and you learn, guys. Yeah. Well, tune in next time when I open something worthwhile. Definitely going to open this mega box at some point. I just don't know when. But stay tuned because that will be upcoming. See you guys.